I hope that you are doing amazing today. It's a bright sunny day outside. Now, before we get into our lesson, let's sing our song together in three, two, one. Let's go. Hello, 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 how are you? Hello, 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 how are you today? Are you happy? Are you angry? Are you sad? Or are you excited today? Is it July? Is it August? Is it September? Or is it October? Great job everyone! Wonderful! That was perfect! You can sit down now! Okay, now we've gone over seasons of the year. We know that there are four seasons of the year and each season is three months long. But what makes our seasons different? What makes our seasons different? How do we know that it is a different season? We know it's a different season because there's a change in temperature. And let's figure this out together. We have four seasons. That's winter. Summer. Spring. And autumn. So how do we know that it is winter? We know that it is winter because it is cold and sometimes even snowy. How about summer? We know that it's summer when it's really very hot and all we want to wear is t-shirts and shorts. We love to eat ice cream in summer, so we know that it's really very hot in summer. How about spring? Spring is cool and hot, but we also know it's spring because there are many flowers that bloom in spring. So how about autumn? Autumn is also very cool, but it is kind of cold as well. Now how do we know that it is autumn? We know it's autumn because leaves start to fall off trees. And that is how we know the difference between the four seasons of the year. Okay, so those are our four seasons of the year and how we know that they are different. We have learned about letters of the alphabet and we're still learning about letters of the alphabet. We have learned about letter O, P and Q. O makes the sound off. O makes the sound O. Oh. P makes the sound P. P makes the sound P. Q makes the sound Q. Qu. Qu. So what comes after Q? Hmm. That is going to be the next letter of the alphabet, which we are going to learn about. Can you look at the board and find your clues, or maybe even the answer? Great job! Wonderful! Our answer is letter R. Letter R. This is big letter R. Capital letter R. This is small letter R. Now, what sound does R make? R makes the sound It's quite a cool sound to make, so let's do it again. R makes the sound R. Let's write big letter R. To do this, we need our pens and our paper. We start at the top of the line and curve in at the middle. Then we come. 
come all the way down. Let's do it together again. One, two, three. Let's draw a small letter R. We start at the middle of the line and we curve. We start at the middle of the line and we curve. So let's do that down here so that we can see it properly. One, two, three. One, two. R makes the sound R. R makes the sound R. R, R, R rain. R, 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 rain. R, R, rain. R, R, rain. R, R, rain. R, R, Rose, r, r, rose, r, r, rose, r, r, robot, r, r, robot, r, r, robot. That is how we say and write the letter R. We're now going to draw an animal that starts with the letter R. What animal starts with the letter R? Very well done. Rabbit. Let's draw a rabbit using big letter R. We're going to start by drawing big letter R. One, two, three. Hmm. What's the coolest thing about a rabbit? Its ears. One, two. Those are our rabbit's ears. Now, what shall we do next? We shall give our rabbit some feet. One, two. And now, how about some toes? One, two. A face. Two little eyes. And a cute little nose. What do you think is missing? What do you think is missing? Very well done. A smiley face and a tail. That is our rabbit. Now remember, R makes the sound R. R makes the sound R. Until next time.